welcome to Big George's Trailer Park Country Kitchen. I'm Big George. And if you're anything like me, not only big, but you got a big family too. Well, my family's so big, we take up this whole trailer park. We live down here in Bunch of Country, Backwoods, Alabama. We're real close, my family and me. Hey, there's only one thing more important to me than family, and that's food. Just the other day, I had to do a fair for my Uncle Stinky. I had to take my cousin Mary Lou to her high school dance. Real ugly thing she is. But you know what? I got to know her real intimate act. I found out things I didn't know about her before. Did you know she ain't a real blonde? She's real ticklish too. Can you poke her at her ass spot? <laughs> She'll squeal like a stuck pig. But dagnabbit stinky gotta teach her some manners. Just the other day we finished our meal. She sat down, loosened up them their trousers, let out this great big old belch, and she reached out and grabbed my big Juicy. Damn, George! Those brownies don't get them starving out of here! Dang, damn it, Stinky, I told you I'd come get you when it's done! Take your smelly hat with you! <laughs> Try that again, Stinky, I'll cut you good! Now, tonight's recipe was inspired by a friend of mine, but I can't use his name because he's wanted by the United States government. But I'll call him Willie Bandito Gomez. <laughs> That's his real name. <laughs> Willie served me up something called refried beans. Mmm, I love refried beans. Only thing better than once fried is twice fried. It's doggone delicious. I couldn't get enough of them beans. I was addicted to them like some sun living city slicker. Hooked on that dead crack cocaine. I'd sell my left bar for another spoonful. Now when I got back to my trailer, I was in a big old rush to get my own version of Willy Bandito Gomez's refried beans. Problem was, I didn't have no brownies. I only had brownies. Lots of brownies. Nothing but brownies. Fudge brownies. With the nuts, gotta have the nuts. Now everybody knows the best thing about brownies is the butter. Butter makes everything better. It's got too many ingredients most commonly used in Big George's country kitchen. Salt and fat. Mm. Now all this talk about food is making me hungry. Let's get down to business cooking tonight's first tasty treat. Big Georgia Southern Style Refried Brownies. Now with all specialty dishes, it's so simple that a punch drunk redneck can cook it in his sleep. First thing you want to do is get yourself some brownies. Then you want to get some butter melted in a pan. Now the next step we want to do is we want to plop them into the melted butter. And don't forget to unwrap them first, you dumb rednecks. As the browns are soaking in the butter, I suggest you lock your doors and windows so your grubby thieving kinfolk can't get in and steal your food. And you know the dumb, we can't see no more butter because the brownie soaked it all in. And there you have it, folks. Baked Georgia Southern Side Refried Brownies. Now that goes better with brownies and an ice cold, delicious bear.
Felicidades. 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 Felicid